All right, y'all, so the time is finally here. Right here. Keep it light. Drop. You will see this. I need all that energy. Run. Get down. Hey. What's going on, y'all? Back here again for the finale of 645. It is week 13. And I'm going to be showing my before and after results for the program. I know I'm wearing an Insanity shirt, but there is a reason for that. So stay tuned uh, towards the end of the video. But anyway, uh, so I'm going to show the featured workout that I shot this week. It will come from Cardio 45. Shot that in the park yesterday. So I'm going to show that to you guys. So make sure to stay after the workout for my before and after and final results. Let's go. All right, y'all, so the time is finally here. It is the last day of 6.45, and I will be doing Cardio 45 for you guys today. Uh, filming outside for the special occasion. Um, I was kind of worried yesterday because it was raining all day. The grass is wet outside, but the, the turf is cool. It, st it stays pretty dry. Um, and I was worried I wasn't going to be able to film outside yesterday. But, uh, yeah, going to go ahead and get it in. And make sure y'all stay tuned after the workout. I'll be going over my final results and wrapping this thing up with a nice bow on top. And uh, let's go ahead and finish this thing off, guys. Let's get it. Right here. Keep it light. Just gonna move nice, slow. All right. So remember, today is the day you gotta empty the tank. Today is the day you gotta give it everything that you got. You worked so hard to be here. All right, y'all, so that's going to do it for 645. It's getting dark out here, so I got to get home. I started late filming. Uh, yeah, I got to do better. But anyway, um, y'all hang around for uh, the before and after. About to go ahead and skip right into that. Uh, so do a little time traveling right to Sunday morning. Let's get it. And today's weigh in. 294. All right, guys, so it's results time. So I'm gonna go over my numbers, my overall thoughts of the program, what's next, and of course the before and after at the end of the video. So let's go into the numbers. Came in at around 294 today for a total loss of nine pounds. I'll be honest, I'm kind of disappointed. Half of me is disappointed. Half of me is like, okay, good job, you know, you are better from where you started. I started at 303 or something like that, if I'm not mistaken. And, um, you know, I'm feeling better from, you know, day one, of course, but I did not hit my goal. Um, I wanted to do 20 pounds and I think it was doable in 13 weeks. If you do two pounds, 13 weeks, that's 26. I did 20. So I feel like it was doable. And I just, I feel like if I kept my momentum going into stage three, uh, the first week of stage three was great. Week nine was awesome. Then week 10, 11, 12, I just completely lost focus, unfortunately. And uh, I had to play catch up towards the end of the workout. Um, I was down at 290, actually. That was my lowest weight. And then I picked it back up during those weeks I was inactive. So, you know, I am disappointed that I did lose focus and just kind of let myself go like that. 
but you know, I had some things going on. Work was crazy and I did not cope with it very well. Uh, bad nutrition, just being inactive, laying around, just like, oh, I don't want to do nothing. The world sucks right now, things like that. Uh, but you know, it's all, it's not all sunshines and rainbows here. I want to be real and relatable. So hopefully you find me that way. But anyway, let's go into the rest of these numbers real quick. Uh, chest 47.5 is actually uh, 48.2 today. Uh, so I went up a little bit. So about two inches lost. Um, waist 44, another two inches there. Bicep about one inch at 16.3. Thigh area 30.7. Uh, both thighs, so two inches between both thighs, of course. Um, the nutrition here, 2B Mindset was a, I think it's a good nutrition program. It's very simple and something I can follow, but I, like I said, I just, I wasn't prepared. I can't follow a nutrition program if I don't have the food and I wasn't grocery shopping. I've been eating out the past couple weeks. So that just led to weight gain. Um, and uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. I'll be honest, I wasn't updating this board. Y'all can see this still says week eight. It's week 13 now. So that shows you I haven't gone to my board. I haven't looked at my goals. I haven't realigned myself with my goals, things like that. I kind of lost my way there. But towards the end, I said, you know what? Let's finish this strong. And so I did the best I could do. Uh, I even redid weeks 11 and 12. Uh, not all the way. Week 11, I did maybe two or three workouts. Week 12, I did two. So uh, and then this week, I did four out of the six workouts. Uh, cardio 45, which y'all just saw me post before this. Uh, but as far as what I'm going into next, you see I'm wearing the Insanity shirt. Um, I was going to redo 645, uh, but I just feel like program is just too dang long uh but i guess before i get into this let's talk about my overall thoughts on the program uh 13 weeks um it gives you some time to mess up that's what i like about longer programs but uh my sweet spot is like 8 to 10 13 weeks was just too long for me and then the first stage kind of bored me i was like okay where's the sauce these moves are kind of basic to be honest uh, so if you're like an insaniac like me and you come from those advanced programs, you're going to be looking for something more in stage one, possibly stage two. And even stage three, I was like, OK, I've seen some of these moves before. What's going on? Uh, honestly, just that was just me. Uh, but not saying, you know, stage two and stage three kick butt. Don't get me wrong. But I just feel like I'm repeating, you know, some of these moves. Um, other than that. Uh, great program, learn some things. And Amalia is very informative. Uh, definitely as far as the mobility and how to, you know, as far as your body movement, things like that, how to land softly on your feet. Uh, you know, those, mo th those mechanics that can help to further increase your performance. Uh, overall, it was a cool program. Some I might come to, but if I do, I will start from stage two and then work up to stage four. I will completely skip stage one. I, I can't do it. <laughs> so um, anyway, uh, but that's just from my perspective. But if you're a beginner, of course, start from stage one. Um, this is a great program to build you up if you're a beginner or intermediate and then, you know, build you up to that advanced level uh, type performance. So um, definitely good in that realm but anyway as far as what's next uh i will be doing a hybrid of insanity um on the dig deeper nation page uh sean t has dubbed this the insane tour so basically go through every form of insanity the original sanity for the first two weeks and then i believe a solemn will be weeks uh three and four volume one volume two and then Insanity Max, I'm not sure if T25 and T20 are included since they're technically not Insanity, right? So uh, the um, the schedule comes out weekly, so I don't know it in full. But that's going to be eight weeks just right up my alley. So um, with this, I'm going to shoot for, I'm going to shoot for 20. I'm going to shoot for 20 again, but uh, 15 to 20 would be great for me. Uh, but I would like to be 275 at the end of the uh, at the end of this next journey that I'm going down here. Uh, but yeah, 
We shall see if that happens. Y'all join in on the fun. I won't be resting up. I already had two weeks of rest doing nothing. That's why I am where I am right now. Um, but yeah, I definitely have my motivation now. This feeling I have, I don't want to feel it again. So um, the next X weeks, uh, hopefully I'll be kicking butt and uh, I'll come with y'all with better news this time. Uh, so that's going to do it for me. I will see y'all next week for the insane tour. Uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Team Out Fitness. I'll see y'all next time. Peace. And oh, here are the before and afters. My bad. <laughs> I'm out.